You just need a handful of everyday spices to make this recipe. If you live in the Middle East, you know exactly what it is. Hi guys and welcome to our channel, The Khan's Creation. Today we are making homemade chicken shawarma. So let's start off with the ingredients. Here we have boneless chicken cubes, half kg. Garlic powder, one tablespoon. Ginger powder, one tablespoon. Onion powder, half tablespoon. Black pepper powder, half tablespoon. Oregano, half teaspoon. Red chili powder, half tablespoon. And turmeric powder, half teaspoon. Olive oil, three to four tablespoons. So in a large bowl, add the chicken and then the rest of the spices and mix everything very well. If you don't have ginger or garlic powder, you can simply add one and a half tablespoon of ginger garlic paste. Also some salt to taste. Now you can either fry the chicken pieces or you can just line up your baking tray with the parchment paper and bake the chicken pieces on about 180 degrees for 15 to 20 minutes. Now the best part to this recipe is the shawarma sauce. Right, we'll start off by adding 2 tablespoons of mayonnaise. Half a cup of yogurt. Four cloves of garlic. Some salt to taste. I'm using about a teaspoon. Lemon juice, three to four tablespoons. Vinegar, one and a half tablespoon. Oil, three to four tablespoons. Mix everything in the blender and it's ready. I will be assembling the shawarma into a pita bread, but if you like, you can use the Arabic bread called hubs, which is what you normally get outside. You can either put the filling onto the top and then just twist it, or cut the pita bread into a half and then put the filling inside. The salad or the filling can be varied. You can use jalapenos, olives, um, black pepper, green chilies, as per your taste. And our homemade chicken shawarma is ready. I just want to say a huge thank you for watching my video. If you're new to my channel, don't forget to subscribe and do tell me in the comment box below that how did it turn out for you. Thank you so much for watching. Allah Hafiz.